Hello and welcome back to linuxjobber.com where we prepare you for Linux jobs. My own name is Sean Me Joseph and my email is showpopulous at gmail.com so feel free to send me any questions and I'll be happy to answer them for you. For today we would be looking at module 8. We're going to go to our website linuxjobber.com and we're going to be looking at module 8 networking basics and these are the tutorials that are available if you want to learn some things from it and but for now we'll be looking at practice question like preparing for uh, an, an actual interview or preparing for Red Hat Certified Systems Administrators uh, exam we're we'll looking at question 8 I mean module 8 and one of the questions there is question number 5 and this is to enter the this command here at the prompt which is a script and it will break the FS tab and there you try to resolve the problem a question like this is very simple and it will probably earn you about six points on a typical exam um, but for today it will be earning you about four points so let's take a look at this very quickly so without wasting more time I'll go to my terminal here and um, run the script and after running the script this is what I get in my FS tab. Now, I don't know what the script broke. There are plenty of things here. I don't know what the screen broke, what the um, script broke in here. So, I guess uh, I just have to reboot and see what happened. So, I'm going to reboot. But while all of this go is going on, I'm going to pause the video just so that I don't keep you waiting for no reason so I'll be back and I'll show you the error that I get when the screen is putting up this is what you're gonna see when the screen is going down and the same thing similar things when the screen is coming back up and then it's probably going to hang that's the whole purpose of the question I'll show you when it comes back up there's no point staring at this messages right now okay so the screen is back and this is where it hangs up you can see where it says field over here and you can see that the reason for failing is, is checking the file systems and the file system check on exe 3 file system unable to resolve level cracked parts so now we know where the problem is this is what you have to watch out for if you're going to look for a job and the interviewer is going to actually put you to test or if you're running your red hat certified systems administrators exam and um, your system won't boot up you have to look at the screen look where it failed and look for um, look for the error message and then you would know which partition is actually causing a problem so now what you need to do is here is asking me to give my root password which I will give to it so when I give my root password it, it gives me uh, a prompt but see the problem is, is that you can't go with this prompt here and open up the file system let me show you let me do it so that, just so that you see it uh, even though as root you can't open up this file system and try to edit anything let's just put something here you see where it says warning it says warning a read only changing a read only file you don't it's not going to let you change it so the lesson for this particular question is that so let's quit and get out of it and now we're back at the prompt you see we're back at the prompt what you want to do is remount that uh, file system so you can use it and you can edit the uh, FS type file so you mount with the option of remount this file system and when you do that now it gives you the permission to edit the tab and if we look for where it says label proc parts where we have a problem it's this one here so I can try to fix it find out what's wrong with it or I can just remove it completely comment it out when I comment it out I know it won't be the one to give me the problem the next time I boot up so I'm going to go and boot up right now and I'm going to hit reboot 
and when I hit reboot let's pause and we're gonna show you what's going on I'll show you what happens later on so here I am back at my login screen it just went through the reboot process and no problem and everything just came back normally that's because we fixed that cracked part error in the file systems tab so I'm going to log in let me log in so back at my screen here um, you can see that um, let's look at the FS tab now um, so look at Etsy FS tab file let's see okay so here's what we commented out and the problem got solved and that answers that question and uh, we should be all set for that question let's take a look at the question yeah and we, we have solved the problem so thank you very much for watching this video uh, my own name is Sean May Joseph here is linuxjobber.com where we prepare you for the, your, your next Linux job my email is showpopulars at gmail.com so if you have any questions please feel free to send it to me and I'll be sure to answer your questions. Thank you very much for watching this video and have a nice day.